y'all can see, we've already started today. It's day one. We've already had uh, some contractors come out here and start cleaning that tree over there. Um, and yeah, it's a mess, but follow me. Rodriguez and I was born here in San Antonio, Texas in the south side of San Antonio and the reason why I uh, joined real estate was because I've always wanted to help people and what better way to help people build wealth in real estate so for me this is just you know this is where my passion is at right now my goal eventually is to become a San Antonio developer but for now we're gonna start with the first Airbnb see how this project goes and hopefully y'all learned a lot I'm definitely gonna learn a lot so you know it's a win-win for us. Please subscribe and follow us. What up, guys? Harry, what's up? Yeah, what's up, man? Can you tell the people what's up? Yes, sir. Hey, what's your, uh, oh, you're calling State Farm? Yes. Yeah. All right, guys, this guy's busy. Uh, he's a businessman. He's another realtor here. He's one of our uh, business partners. But, uh, Harry, hey. what do you think about real estate in downtown San Antonio? Oh, it's booming right now. Like. Yeah? It's always been moving, a lot of revitalization going on, so definitely, if you've been thinking about buying, this is the time to get in. If you've been holding on any piece of property in downtown San Antonio, definitely, now it's not a bad time to sell. We, we, what are the, the areas you're trying to buy at right now? Oh, tons. You got Lone Star, Lone Star, Government Hill, Beacon Hill, Tobin Hill, anything that's got a hill in it. Um, <laughs> Mankey Park. Dignity, almost Denver like Heights, Denver Heights, Denver anything, Heights, anything, anything inside. Oh. Hey guys, it's Rich Rodriguez. Thank you for joining. Thank you for watching. This is our first vlog on our Airbnb. So as y'all know, I actually just bought this one uh, last month and we just started. Today's day one. Uh, we got the foundation guys out there right now working. So that's actually going to be your first step guys on your first uh, flip or whatever it is. You uh, might want to get somebody to take a look at your foundation and get that started. Uh, we came across a small problem though. I had actually contracted somebody to knock that tree in the back. As you see it, they used to kind of wrap around over the, the house uh, but so it's very important to make sure whoever you hire as your contractors make sure they're liable because this guy did half the job and never came back so we actually had to contract uh, Pro Green Clean LLC who came to the rescue to pretty much take over uh, remove all the branches and uh, get rid of all the mess that that other contractor did so All right guys, so I just wanna show y'all our foundation. So this, these homes were probably built in 1990 something. And as you can see, these foundations right here, they're all rotten. So all this is gonna have to be replaced. Um, a foundation could run anywhere from five to 7,000 on a home. So, you know, you always wanna shoot for, for high numbers. So uh, just keep that in mind. All this is gonna have to get replaced. 